Jax knows everything. Don't tell me, Miranda. Miranda read the letter that I wrote to you. I, you know, I should have dumped that woman out of a plane when I had a chance. You okay? Yeah. I'm a little blown away that he's known this this whole time and he never told me anything about it. He's a really good person. He cares about me a lot. But you're here. I'm here. Um, Joseph, can you uh, give me some privacy for some? Sure. Should you be out here alone right now? No. We could go somewhere else. This is my life, Brenda. I pay people to follow me so other people won't kill me. You stand there can be in the line of fire. If that scares you, which it should, maybe you want to reconsider because this is the way it's always going to be. Why are you telling me this right now? Full disclosure, no more lies between us. That way you won't get blindsided. You asked me if I was a mobster. The answer is yeah. Do you know why I came here? I don't, I don't, I don't have to know. I can see it in your eyes. Whatever you hold on to before is gone. You're free. Do you think that means I want you? Don't you? I kind of wanted to say it for myself. Not until you're sure of you, of me, of the life we're going to have. Tonight's the night we make it work. Or we walk away forever. Wait a minute. Wait, so... Now you're talking about us walking away? You've been coming after me forever. Even when you were trying to stay away from me, I could still feel you wanting me. So, do you want to explain to me what's changed since the last time you said we belong together? Nothing. That's, that's the point. I... I wanted you so much that I conveniently forgot the fundamental problem between us. It's not, it's not Jax or you wanting to find yourself. It's you want to know things that I can't tell you. My first solution was to lie. But I told the truth this afternoon and neither worked. So what we're left with is you can't know anything about my business. Either you accept that or you don't. It's up to you. But you don't think that I would betray you? Not intentionally, but... In... Intentions aren't what matters here. Only results. Okay. Sonny, when you lied to me for all that time about what you do, it scared me. Because you broke our trust. And I wore the wire. But I want you to know I never would have told the police anything. It's the truth. Can we find a way to let all this go finally? I almost hit you. You think I can forget that? grab me. I felt my fist clench. I try to walk away. You would come at me. Huh? I had your face in my hand. You were screaming and crying and for a second I didn't know the difference between you and my mother or me and Deke. Sonny, the difference is you didn't hit me. And I know that you would never hit me. We both screwed up that night. But look at us. See how we always find our way back to each other? Because we really love each other. Listen. Oh, God. I don't care about the details of your business and anything that you cannot tell me. I will try and understand. Because all I want is to be with you. What about the 
better, stronger Brenda. I am the better, stronger Brenda. Do you know, I used to think that I couldn't live without you. Now I know that I can. I just don't want to. <laughs> oh, see, this means that you could leave me right now. You could walk out of here. You could leave me standing in the rain, and I wouldn't need anyone to rescue me, because I would be okay on my own. But I'd miss you forever. I'm not leaving. I'm just making sure. Because somewhere along the line, things got complicated. It all got to be about lies and truth and trust in other people, which is important, but it, it's not as important as you and me. From that day in that car dealership till now, nothing, and I mean nothing, has been stronger than us. I couldn't fight it then. I can't fight it now. The difference is, I love you. And I just want you to know what you're getting. I'm getting the only thing I've ever really wanted. I love you too. You know, when you told me that, um, Wasting time was like laughing in God's face. You were right. I don't want to waste any more time. And you know, he said that the next time you kissed me, it would be because I came to you. thought this was going to happen. I actually convinced myself that I didn't want it to happen. What changed? Me. I got stronger. I grew up, maybe. You know, I know you don't want to hear this, but Jax had something to do with it. Mm, you're right, I don't want to hear I know it. you don't want to, but it's just this one little thing I want to tell you. <sighs> See, Jax made me realize that the reason why I was suffering wasn't because I couldn't tell him about you and I making love in the cave. It was because I couldn't tell him that I still love you. And now that I have, you're right. I do feel free. I love you. I already told you that. Yeah. You did. The one who has to give Jax all the credit. Oh, honey. I'm sorry. Did what? you want some credit? Because, you know, I give you all the credit you want. I give you anything you want. You know what? What? I got, I've had a lot of things happen to me, right? Good, bad, whatever. Yeah. But this is going to be the best. What are you trying to say? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm happy. Yeah. Just happy, happy. <laughs> and, uh... I'm in love with you. And, uh... I never want to lose you. You never will. 